7,000 nurses walked off their hospital floors this week. It's had a major impact, mm -hmm. right? And two major hospitals, Montefiore here in the Bronx and Mount Sinai's main campus in Manhattan have come to an agreement with the nurses union. So we want to send it out to News 12's Noelle Lilly, who has been at the picket lines every day since the strike began and tells us where things are now. A different feeling than the past few days, Noelle. Definitely a much more positive mood and uplifting vibe here outside of Mount Sinai in Manhattan. We did also hear from Governor Hochul, who came down to celebrate with the nurses, and she says that this is a win for all New Yorkers. Now, we know, again, this strike, as you guys said, has had a very big effect on our city's health care system, with some hospitals having to cancel surgeries and some doctors even filling in as nurses. The nurses' union said that early offers from Mount Sinai and Montefiore focused on increasing pay instead of their major concern, which has consistently been staffing shortages. But now the union tells us that both hospitals have committed to safe staffing ratios. At Montefiore, the nurses will get a 19.1% wage increase, 170 new nurse positions, fully funded health care plans, plus extra nurses in the emergency room. And over at Mount Sinai here, they will also be adding safe staffing ratios at all inpatient units, plus infer enforcement of safe staffing. We caught up with the president of the nurses union who got choked up over what she called a victory. Happy our nurses have gone back to work. Happy with the nurses received the ratios in order to care for their patients or wages. We're just happy. We're just happy overall. It's really an emotional for us. So it's really great today we're able to do it. Now, we should keep in mind that these are tentative agreements, so they're not done deals yet, but it's still a major step forward for the nurses and the hospitals alike. Both hospitals and the union also agreed to immediate return to work notices, so we have already started to see some of those nurses head back into the hospital to get back to the bedside taking care of their patients. That's the latest for now at Mount Sinai Main Campus in Manhattan. Noelle Lilly, News 12.